Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazzpeeshobbyland.com with our first random team break of 2018 Topps Chrome Baseball. This is a 12-box hobby edition. Big thank you to these folks for getting into the action. And let's see here. We comboed some teams. Mariners, Rockies, Rangers, Blue Jays, and we threw out the Tigers, Royals, or Padres, Royals, and Tigers. So Padres... Royals and Tigers. So any of the numbered cards that pop out of here will be randomized to the group in one lot. Obviously, no, no vet base will ship for those teams either. So we'll do a randomizer at the end for that. And we'll also have a randomizer. Let's set, set that up right now. We'll also have a randomizer at the end. Actually, in one list, we'll do it all in one list. We'll have the Dog Days of Summer promo, and the second name will get the any of the extra team ones, if any. All right, let's roll the dice. Let's randomize each list. Three and a six, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. All right, we got Mario on the pole. And Courtney in the 25 spot. Once again, nine times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, we've got the Mets on top and the White Sox in the 25 spot. All right, so Mario, you have the Mets. Jared with the Astros. TC with the Indians. Big Boy, Zolo 7. Dave, you got the Marlins. Matthew K, Last Spot, Mojo, Red. Scott McNulty, Cubs and Rays. Jeremy 33, Diamondbacks. Jeremy Terrell, Pirates. Manuel, you got the Red Sox. Nicole, you got the Rockies and the Mariners. Corey K with the Nats. Benny and the Jets with the Yankees. Scott with the Giants. Good to see you, Benny. Allen with the Cardinals. Patrick K with the A's. Jeremy 33, O's. Garza, you got the Braves, TC with the Angels, nice. Benny with the Phillies, Amber, you got the Rangers-Blue Jays combo spot. Uh, Lucas with my Dodgers, Daniel Patero with the Brew Crew, they're playing each other. Megan with the Twins, and Court, you got the White Sox. So let's sort by column B. Let's box them up. Any trades, ladies and gentlemen? Remember, this is a 12-box hobby. What are the twelve? What is the twelve box hobby? A one autograph per box? I guess we're gonna we're gonna find out in just a second. But I got it right here. Hobby twelve boxes, two autos per box. We got jumbo editions, ladies and gentlemen. We got jumbo pick your teams that are sold out. You gotta just do those spot randoms on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Someone asked if uh, if we had any more Chrome. We do. I will post more. Um, I'll post more uh, hobby Chrome after this but we got two pick your team jumbo breaks that are sold out already ladies and gentlemen but we just have to move those spot randoms all right let's close the trade window let's print this out all right i gotta change the channel we were watching the football game on NBC. Now it's on local news. Now it's on extra. Oh, come on. As much as I would like to learn more about Khloe Kardashian post baby, I'm afraid we're going to have to go to quick pitch. On MLB Network. All right, here it is. Here's the final list. Good luck, everybody. Thanks for getting into the action. Although I am kind of curious. She 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 got fit really fast. At the end of the break, there'll be the promo. How did she do that? Now I'm kind of curious.
All right, all right, Alan. Have a good night. Hopefully, we'll you'll wake up to some strong hits here. All right, there's all twelve boxes right there. Get comfortable, relax, everybody, because uh, this is gonna take a little bit. Rich says drugs. Are are you saying illegal drugs, Rich? It's a family show. What would I give up for a Kardashian, Mario? What do you mean? To what would I give up to make sure I never see them again, ever on television? Oh, diet drugs. I see. Oh, Mario. Oh, I see, Mario. You actually you like the Kardashians. I see. I I know what kind of girls Mario likes now. I see. I see you. Um, the, the Kardashian girls are trouble, Mario. You see, like, basketball players openly talk about, about the Kardashian curse. <laughs> Mario's like, I don't like the show, though. Mario, you sound like a good kid. Uh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't get involved with fast women like that. Rich says I would rather date Bruce. He is a gold medalist. Rich, no one. No one would blame you. No one would blame you. A gold medal winning decathlete. Landon, what's going on? Right, Caitlin. All right, box number one. Two autographs per box, folks. Good luck, plus parallels. Let's see what we got. So stuff like this will ship. Obviously, this is considered vet based, so that won't ship. Refractors, of course, will ship. I don't think those are numbered. No, they're not. This obviously will ship because that's Hunter Wood for the Rays. And that'll be for the Rays. Scott McNulty with the Rays. There's Chris Archer. I like that uniform. There's Addison Russell. That's numbered to $299. We'll set these aside. We'll have the shipping team sleeve and top load those before they uh, before they get sent out. But just in the interest of time, we'll set those aside. Oh, got Amari Cooper hands right there. Sorry. And there's our next autograph, Breivik Valera for the Cardinals. That's for Allen. Oh, he just went to bed. Allen, you got an autograph early. Look at Adrian Belcher right there. Looks looks like uh, looks like the thinker. Just thinking. We'll save one of these Otanis. And there you go. These are your autographs. And next box. Good luck. Scott McNulty was about to give up the raise in this break until that autograph popped out. Rex is asking if anybody's feed is laggy. Is anyone, any, anyone's feed lagging? Here we 
here. If you feel like it is, let me drop the uh, drop the little PSA, the public service announcement here in the chat. All right, so sorry, box two. Um, we've got jumbo editions of this break, folks. Hops Chrome Baseball already sold out. We just need to move those spot randoms. Now, that break probably won't happen until tomorrow, but we can still sell out a spot random tonight. So check that out on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Pay a fraction of the price. Try to, get the, uh, try to get the Angels or the Yankees. And either break two, pick your team two, or pick your team three, both of which are sold out. We're just waiting on those spot randoms. So keep an eye on that on jazbeeshobbyland.com. No, no one else's feed is lagging. Or maybe everyone is lagging and they're just going to respond like an hour later. They're like, yes. <laughs> I'll be like, oh, no. All right. There's Nikki Del Monaco freshman flash autograph. That'll be for the White Sox. That'll be for Courtney. Two out of 99. Nice. Nice. Jeremy33 says immaculate random numbers. Maybe maybe everyone is lagging behind. Nice Otani. And Harrison Darth Bader. Another autograph for Allen. Maybe Alan should go to bed before a break more often. All right, there you go. Hey. Rich is like, hey, say hey as soon as you see this, and I'll count. Bowman Chrome comes out. I'm not sure when Bowman Chrome comes out. Four seconds, that's really good, Rich. You have maximized your Jaspi experience. Maybe no one's just responding. <laughs> so I don't know if we're lagging behind. Rich, you're not lagging behind. You're just, you're, you're just fine. Wow, Walker Bueller, red. Two out of five. Does everyone see this? Wow. That's a nice one for Lucas Snow and the Dodgers. Getting that Dodger Joe Mojo. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. That is nice. That'll wake some people up. Doesn't matter what break we do, folks. Nice hits all oh, nice hits all over the place. We'll save that for picture on Twitter at Jaspie's Hobbyland. Yeah, that red looks really cool. Like, what what did they do with that? And almost it's there's almost like it's like a smoke cloud in the back, right? Something like that. Like someone set off a like a flare at a soccer game or something like that. It looks like a cloud of smoke or something like that in the background. I like it. Looks nice.
All right. Um, everyone, double check to make sure that you are uh, live, or maybe even refresh your stream. I feel like a few. I feel like I'm getting a few, uh, like James Davidson and and um, Jeremy Thirty Three. kind of sets a couple comments out of context like jeremy 33 was just like random number block break and then james davidson sounds like he was responding to the K kardashian com comment we were conversation we were talking about a few boxes ago so all all everyone double check even if you even if your stream seems fine I just want to make sure it's 9 20 on the west coast right now so we're at the 20 minute mark all right i see amber James Davidson says he's good now. <laughs> Drift, Mario saying, Kardashian greater than symbol X. Any Kardashian is greater than your X? I guess that's why the X is an X, right? Jeremy33 says, I love Immaculate. I do too. I'd be down to do that. We'll have time for it after this break. Yeah, that Robles negative was cool. That goes to Corey K. How short printed are those? I don't know how short printed they are. Does it say on the back of this package here? I'm sure we can find out. <laughs> Courtney? I mean, um, I don't know the names of them. Drift, what are you talking about? There's Victor Robles freshman flash again. <laughs> Rich, what are you talking about? How do I how do I edit all these how do I edit these videos? I gotta edit that part out. We'll fix that in post. We don't have post production folks. It's just li it's live to tape. Did I miss an autograph? Where oh there's an Alright, any guesses on that? Redemption? Sometimes the autographs are hard to see in this set. Out of 299, there's Brandon Woodruff. Oh, there's the other autograph. There's AJ Minter. It's kind of a cool autograph. Does he always sign like that? I'd like to see more AJ Minter autographs. Garza for the Bravos. Then we got Tyler Wade to 75. Amber says Walker Bueller. Yeah, it usually is, right? What about the music, Jeremy33? There's no music right now for the breaks. Otherwise, they'll mute the, they'll mute the stuff. Mario apparently... Oh, his favorite is Chloe. He likes him thick, he says. That Woodruff was a 299. All right, so behind J.P. Crawford, congratulations, you are due to receive a rookie autograph blue refractor parallel of M. That's an upside down W. My, Mike? Mikhail? Mike? Mike Soroka. That's a, that's a brave, right? I'm not familiar with... Pretty sure he's a brave. He is. Nice one for... I need a pen. Uh, that'll go to Garza. So you got the AJ Minter Garza and the Mike Soroka. Late first round pick in 2015, apparently. Isn't he about to come up soon? Is he up? He's from Calgary. Maybe Curtis knows him. Curtis, are you listening? 
Curtis is in Calgary. All right, next one. Oh yeah, he was he was born and went to high school. Curtis, where are you? He went to Bishop Carroll High School in Calgary. Curtis might know Mike Soroka. Man, yeah, Curtis could have told us all sorts of trivia about Mike Soroka. He's Mike Soroka, pretty he's Canadian. Stereotypically, Canadians are pretty nice. We won't see any mean tweets from him. I'll bet he does. I don't know how many I'll bet Curtis knows a moose too, and Mike Soroka. They both know mooses. I don't know any moose. Moose meese. I don't know any meese. Mooses? Wait, are, are moose one of those things where where one moose is still a moose and a group of mooses are still a moose? No, they're a herd. They're a herd of moose. Meese. Oh, uh, so it's both. So mo I, I saw I saw some moose. I saw a moose. Works both ways. Mo mooses. Mooses. Meese. All right. Next box. All right. There's some Otani. We'll save one of those. There's Tyler Maley. I think he got rocked today. That goes to Michael K and the Reds. Guys ever look up uh, guys ever look up uh, animal groupings like a group of animals are called a such and such like for example a murder of crows you guys heard heard of this right What are some other fun ones uh, I think a dolphin is a pod of doll I think what, what's a group of hedgehogs There's orange Billy Hamilton in a nice jaspy orange 5 out of 25 for the reds that's another one from Michael K. Now I think a pod is a pod of wh whales come in pods, right? Salmon so Rosario. Justin Turner is back in the lineup. Thought I saw him. Should have one more autograph. Where are you, Otto? Oh, there it is. There's Walker Bueller. No redemption on this one. That is for Lucas. I guess he's a redemption in Panini, but not for Tops. <laughs> or was it vice versa? I forget now. All right. There you go. Dodgers. Lucas Snow with my Dodgers. Michael K with the Reds. Another box to go. Yeah, if that red was autoed, I, I honestly don't know how well B Walker Buehler does on a secondary market, but I know Dodger fans are very excited about him. He's supposed to be supposed to be the next big ace. He's coming off an arm surgery from last year, I think. So I think they're I think they're kind of being uh, cautious with his innings. Wow, the Dodgers have have put a 21 spot 
on the Brew Crew, 21 to 5. Top of the eighth. Brewers up to bat, but. Wow. We might see a. Uh, we might see a position player. Might see a position player up to bat, or up up to pitch. Good luck, folks. We're going we're gonna to see who's been doing the damage for the Dodgers. All right, we'll check that in a second. There's Verdugo. There's Anthony Banda for the Rays. That's out of 150. That'll go to Scott McNulty. There's Jordan Luplo. Jordan goes to the Pirates. That'll be for Jeremy Terrell. I thought that might have been in gold for a second. It's not. There's Adrian Sanchez for the Nats. That goes to Corey K. Amber's thinking, man, I wish, wish I'd gotten the Nationals this time around. Well, this was a random. I, it, would have, it would have been tough. You'd have to rely on random.org to help you out there. There's Michael Fulmer. I like this design right here. I think that's pretty sharp. I think some of those can be autographed too. Keep an eye out for that. Nice, another one of those Otanis. Green Dallas Keuchel, 68 out of 99 for the Strohs. That'll go to Jared. And that's that. Next box. Now remember, folks, the, the spot randoms for the Angels and the Yankees on jazpiecehobbyland.com, the consolation prizes is a box of this. So we take a, a fresh box and we take out the 24 packs and then each spot random is, is a fresh box. So, I mean, you could be getting any number of these of these nice, there's two out of every box, so each spot random should get, you know, two autographs. Someone's going to have to get them. Could be you if you end up with the constellation. So check that out, jazpiecehobbyland.com, the Angels and Yankees spot random, jazpiecehobbyland.com. All right, we're making some good time here. We're pretty much halfway through. After this box, we'll be halfway through the break. Let's see who's doing the damage for the Dodgers. They're up 21-5 to five in the top of the eighth inning in L.A. Brewers are still batting right now. they got two outs on them right now. Uh, Jock Peterson, two for six with four RBIs. Three runs scored. Justin Turner, two for three. Or one for two with two RBIs. Who else? So who's doing the damage? Oh, Cody Bellinger has a bunch of RBIs. Two for four with five RBIs. Brian Dozier, two for five with four RBIs. And Yasiel Puig, three for five with four RBIs. So those guys are the ones doing some of the damage. James Davidson said, just starting watching baseball. I like the Braves. 
I'll be 46, just cannot sit that long and watch a game. Huh. That's kind of funny because you, you, a lot of times baseball is often criticized that it's just, it's just uh, you know, guys in their 40s or 50s who are just sitting there watching a long baseball game. <laughs> Now they gotta. I don't know what they gotta do. They gotta. They gotta speed up the game somehow. I, I'm. I'm a. I'm a big baseball guy. I love baseball. So I. I'm one of those rare people that, I think, can and enjoy watch most games from start to finish on TV or at the ballpark. But even I can admit, as a, even as a big baseball fan, they gotta. They gotta try working out that pace of play stuff somehow, and I'm I'm not even necessarily saying use a clock or something like that, but but it's gotta be they gotta do something. <laughs> they could, there's gotta be more more balls put into play. I think that's what it has to be. Amber says, um, her and the husband can watch. Can watch the Nationals as long as it's not ESPN. Yeah, the ESPN broadcast can, can be a little rough sometimes. All right, next box. But, I mean, I think it's either – there's Anthony Stantner for the uh, Orioles, Jeremy 33. I mean, people often say um, – people often say – That it's just a true outcome game, right? It's just a, you're just a walk, a strikeout, or a home run. But if if that's it, that gets kind of boring after a while, right? It's just a walk, strikeout, or home run. Forty-two out of fifty, Matt Chapman. Um, so there's no balls being put into play. No, no like bloop singles or slap singles. You know, no slap hitters anymore. What happened to the slap hitter? Yeah, and. and and at some point, maybe you think, oh, that small ball is kind of boring, blah, 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 blah. But then you realize, oh, it actually, Didi Gregorius, black and white. Then you kind of realize, oh, maybe that kind of is what made the game move along a little bit nicely. Jacob Barnes for the Brew Crew going to Daniel Patera. You know, if guys are bunting a little more often, trying to put the ball in play more often, not just hit a home run or strike out, then there's a little more action. I also think I also think that they should um, and I don't think this is too radical of an idea, but if they limit the amount of pitchers that you can use, I think that could help speed up the game a little bit. And then you can still retain, in my opinion, you can still retain you know specialized pitchers. But not have, you know, the example of one pitcher coming for one batter, then another relief pitcher comes out for one batter, then another, you know. I think that could help limit that. I'd rather have that than, like, mound visit numbers, a clock, pitch clock or something like that. I'm not sure if that actually, actually does it. All right, we are halfway through the break, ladies and gentlemen. For example, this Brewers-Dodgers game, you know, how many pitchers have the Brewers used by this point? Five, they're on their fifth pitcher now. Yeah, I love the football as well, James. I could watch it all all day as well. I think the perfect the perfect month of sports, ladies and gentlemen, has got to be like October, where you have playoff baseball, where you're a few weeks into the football season. I think late October you may start to get a little hockey and a little basketball. I think they're starting their seasons a little bit earlier than usual. At least they started doing that last year. And then I think like if you if you guys like racing, chase for the cup. I think the last few races are in in early October as well. 
you know, college football is in full swing by that point as well. So there's a, that's like the perfect month of, of, of sports where everything just comes together. Or every day there's, there's something. Football season at Jazby's Hobby Land is pretty fun, folks. We like to do a lot. We, we discuss a lot of fantasy football, discuss a lot of our picks. We, we do, I think we're going to have our, have some sort of pro football pick em contest or something like that. Yeah, either for bragging rights or, or stuff. I don't know. We always do something. All right, good luck, everybody. Next box. And our first auto, Rowdy Reed for the Nats. Um, I think in about four weeks or so is when football starts back up, Sublime. It goes to Corey K in the Nats. Oh, redemption. Any guesses on the redemption? We'll set that right there. Green John Lester, 84 out of 99, Green Wave. And this is the one per case rookie medallion, Noah Syndergaard. Some of these can be autographed, too. And that goes to Mario and the Mets. There you go, Mario. Card Blast. Sanford's guessing uh, Chris Bryant. Charlie Blackman to 75. The Charlie Blackman. Blue wave was to 75, and the Lester green wave to 99. I got a Calhoun guess. I got a Chris Bryant guess. I got a Walker Bueller guess. All right, so behind Cody Bellinger, you are due to receive a rookie autograph of... Oh, almost showed it off. I don't know if those letters look like any of our guesses. R A F Raphael Devers? Raphael Devers. And that goes to the red Manuel Garza. Garza, there you go. Gets randomized the Red Sox, picks up the Raphael Devers. Nice. There you go. So we got the the one per case. We got the Rowdy Reed. Scott guessing Bryant. You might be lagging behind a little bit, sir. I don't know. Maybe something weird happened with YouTube and everyone started lagging behind or they kicked everyone back a few minutes. All right, good luck, ladies and gentlemen. I see eight orders coming in. That's a decent amount of orders for this late at night. What, what's what's moving along on the website, ladies and gentlemen? Someone let me know. 
I saw Greg with an order, Chris Fedor with an order, Jeremy33 with a couple orders, Scott V, William L, Rich, John Samuelson still wants to play. What, what, what have you guys been picking up? Because by the time this break is over, in about, oh, I don't know, 20 minutes or so, we'll be ready for another. Oh, the random number block break sold out. Nice. All right. So that will take us pretty much to the bottom of next hour. So that leaves us with another, um, with another, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes to go in the broadcast. So we can squeeze another break in, probably in, probably a small quick break. Leaf is down to six, says Rich. Yeah, Leaf, we can definitely do. That'll be an easy one to do. How's that noir doing? Do we do we? Some people want to do some noir basketball. We can do that as well. A lot, of, a lot of fun ways to close out the night. I'm glad we did that immaculate number block break. Nice. So a couple baseball breaks in a row. Love it. All right, next box. Good luck. Parker Bridwell is the auto for the Angels. That'll be for TC and the Angels. We'll get that Mike Trout as well. There's Alex Wood. Reese Hoskins, Tommy Pham. Carlos Correa, Corey's brother Kyle. There's Chris Bryant Green to 99. That goes to the Cubs. That'll be for Scott. And Curie Maya for the Reds. Matthew K. Last spot Mojo with another hit. Two red teams getting the two autographs. All right, one, two, three, four boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. So what were the scores today in baseball? Padres being the Cubs 6-1. The Rangers putting up 17 runs on the... Orioles, 17-8, Rangers. The Red Sox with 15 runs. Double-digit runs there, 15-7 over the Yankees. Braves, 4-2 over the Mets. Nationals putting up double-digit, 10-4 over Cincinnati. The uh, Phillies over the Marlins, 5-2. White Sox, 6-4 over the Royals. Cardinals edging out the Rockies, 3-2. Rays 4-2 over the Angels. Dodgers putting up 21 on the Brew Crew, 21 to 5 at the moment. Wasn't yesterday there was a 20? Yesterday. Just yesterday. No? Was it the night before that? Maybe it was the night before. Just the night before, the Nationals had pounded out 25 runs. Giants leading the Diamondbacks 8-1. to one. And uh, Toronto leading 4-2. to two. I thought it was yesterday, Amber. It's a lot of runs. The Nationals were just... Were, 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 their bats were going bananas. There are a lot of crooked numbers in that game. All 
All right, next box. Good luck. We got Daniel Murphy to 150. There's Lucas Sims for the Bravos. That goes to Garza and the A and the A's. They got A's on their <laughs> their hats. The Atlanta Braves. Oh, yeah, hopefully he does get them back on track. What happened with um? There's Bryce. What happened with Sean Kelly? What was what was the story there? So, towards the end of that game, if you guys don't know, I'm sure a lot of you saw. It was on like all the, all the networks. Um, Sean Kelly enters the game in that 25 to whatever game late, um, and gives up a home run. And kind of threw a tantrum. Yeah, threw a tantrum, right, Amber? And then slammed down his glove, but seemed like he had glared into the dugout at the manager, perhaps? And then the GM definitely was like the next day he was released, designated for assignment. He was done. There's Brian Anderson, Marlins, but he seemed to claim that he's like, oh, I wasn't glaring into the dugout. He seemed to claim it wasn't that. But I guess my question was, Amber, since you're a Nationals fan, is this kind of like – I'm not not familiar with Sean Kelly. Is that kind of his M.O.? Has he always been kind of a kind of a crybaby? Is that what's been happening? Like through a temper tantrum? Is he that guy? That's the kind of feeling that I got. Like this wasn't like the first time he threw some kind of tantrum like this. And then, you know, he kind of threw that tantrum. No, he's been a decent dude? Okay. Thought it was kind of a... That's Sean Doolittle. I thought that was kind of an odd situation then. Oh, the umps were pushing him, but he certainly looked into the dugout. Yeah, his numbers haven't been super great. But then I guess if you're going to throw a tantrum, that doesn't help either. Especially when the Nationals are under this pressure to really climb back into the into the race. All right, next one, folks. All right, just a few boxes to go. We're almost there, ladies and gentlemen, almost there. So we got two, four, six autographs to go. We saw the the one per case medallion, which was neat. I think some of those are autographs, so we may have to dig look for those in some of our future breaks. It's the final in LA. Dodgers twenty one, the Brewers five. Dodgers put up nine runs in the bottom of the seventh inning. Crazy. 18 hits, 21 runs. Brewers finish with 9 hits, 2 errors, and 5 runs. That must be... That's got to be a long game. What's, what's, the, what's the game time on that? Ooh, three hours and 42 minutes. It's kind of a long game. What's the longest game, baseball game, that everyone's been to? I want to say I saw a a Dodgers-Rockies game or something like that a number of years ago that went like 15 innings or something like that. Three hours and 42 minutes is long for, for regulation nine innings. All right, your next auto is Alex Verdugo. Nice Verdugo auto for Lucas and my Dodgers. Seventy-three out of four ninety-nine. 
that's that is false, Rex. Rex says this is the break that never ends. That's false. This break will be ending in about ten or fifteen minutes. There is an end to this break. Oh man, Drift saying Mario saying last season there's an Angels against someone. Started at seven p.m. ended at one a.m. That's brutal. There's Ryder Jones for the Giants. So Dodgers and Giants in this box. Scott McNulty going oppo, Joe Mojo. There's Hanley Ramirez out of 99. I'm surprised Hanley Ramirez hasn't been picked up. Right? The Red Sox released him. I guess maybe maybe he just carries too much salary. But you would think that some I I would think that some AL team would be like, "Yeah, we can slot him in at DH. We can use him there." All right, two boxes to go. Quickest game I went to. I was thinking. I was thinking about like, okay, not the longest game. What's the quickest game I've been to? The fastest game, baseball game I went to, was. And I, I distinctly remember this. This is. It was a. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't know when, but it was a Zach Ranky start, and it was a Memorial Day game, a Memorial Day weekend game or something like that. Maybe a Sunday, Sunday or Monday. Traffic as usual in Los Angeles was pretty bad, especially on a Memorial Day weekend. Everyone was going to the ballpark. I forget who the Dodgers were playing, but Zach Granke I knew was starting. And I we thought you know we we're going to be a little late. We we're like okay, we're gonna battle traffic. We're climbing up the the big hill to Dodger Stadium. We're like all right, it's going to take you know maybe we'll miss the first couple innings or something like that. Not too bad. We'll still have X amount of hours left. You know just to hang out, have a couple beers. And I think after we were there, because especially there, because afterwards, I think they let you walk onto the field, and there was like some sort of thing going on, um, which I thought was cool. So we like got to go on the field, and we got there thinking we were only going to be, we we're only like 30, 30 minutes late or something like that, 30, 40 minutes late. It was already like in the third or fourth inning. Like Zach Greinke and the other pitcher were just dealing. Guys were just, it was just like one, two, three innings, left and right. It was just, the game was breezing along. I think the game ended like in two hours. So we got there a little late. We only got to see, like, before you knew, we blinked and it was like, oh, dang, it's seventh inning. We got to, like, we got to stretch. We got to buy our last beers. And, and the game was over. Shohei Otani. It's an Otani day, ladies and gentlemen. TC, wake up, Tim. Are you awake, Tim? Wake up. I pulled you an Otani out of a random break. 54 out of 250. It's a Shohei Otani day, ladies and gentlemen. I know Rich called it. Rich Schmidt called it from earlier. We pulled one out of. We pulled one out of. Uh, out of the Panini Immaculate Break, one of the Immaculate Breaks today, and now we pulled one out of this Topps Chrome Baseball Break. Are we on? Are we on a? Are we on an Otani heater today? DC's like Joe, you did it. Out of two ninety nine, and there's Max Freed for Garza and the Braves.
Man, a, a random break of all things? <laughs> That's kind of crazy. How much how much a spot was this? How much was a spot? Spot was like what? 60 70 bucks? 70 bucks? 70 bucks a spot for a random team? There's Dominic Smith at a 99. Gregor Polanco. <laughs> Rex is like, who's never heard of Otani? Who is this guy? Is that new new Hispanic player in baseball? It is numbered. That's right. Fifty four out of two fifty. Wow. Second to last box. Fifty eight dollars for this break? Well, whatever the case is. And you got lucky enough to get randomized the Angels and there was an Otani in here. That's truly magic, TC. This is why we play the game. This is the thrill of the chase, ladies and gentlemen. It says chrome. Not refractor. All right, last box, ladies and gentlemen. Well, maybe we'll see an Otani in the next break. I think we got another baseball break coming up. Two more autographs to go. And I'm sure that Otani kind of perked people up. I got to take a picture of that right away, too. At Jaspie's Hobbyland or Twitter, at Jaspie's Hobbyland Instagram. Right, that was that was ridiculous too, Mario. Drift's like, yeah, when I got that Angels in the spot random in Definitive Collection and then hit the out of five Trout and then hit the out of five Pools. I mean, it's a thrill of the trace, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone knows. I think I think most people get it. You know, the, there's, there's, there's levels of risk. It's a gamble. But sometimes it works out. Um, are any of those out of two fifties on 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 eBay? That's got to be. I don't know. Easily, what in my head I see four four fifty American dollars, U.S. dollars, give or take. I don't know. I don't know how many. It could be depending on how many. Or on eBay. All right, last box. Good luck, everybody. Kershaw got the win today. Well, I mean, is it sold out? I'm down if it is. We got time. I, kn I know the immaculate random number block break is done, but we've got time to do elements if people wanted to. How many spots are left in that? There's Brandon Woodruff to 499. That is for the Brew Crew. That one says Chrome Refractor on it. That Otani just said Chrome on it. That goes to the Brewers. That's to uh, Daniel Patera. Daniel Murphy to 299 Drift is like dang no Mets autos We have we have one more auto left Mario Do you want to give up? You want to sell me the you want me to give me the uh, Mets? You want to take that chance? 
I'll refund you 11 twelfth of the break. No? Ah, oh, you should have taken it, Drew. It's Chris Stratton, Giants, Scott McNulty, Oppo Joe Mojo. There you go. Wow, Dylan J says, he says he looked it up. He said 875 best offer accepted for that Otani out of 250. So yeah, about 800 ish doesn't sound too crazy. All right, and that that is that, ladies and gentlemen. There you go. What a break. We got that nice uh, Walker Bueller red at the beginning of the break. That was two out of five. And then, of course, <laughs> that Otani to 250. Strong. All right. We've got a Dog Days of Summer promo spot to give away. So there you go. Everyone has a shot from Jeremy down to Corey. Let's get him into this list here. Let's randomize that list. Six and a one, lucky seven times. Name on top gets the Dog Days of Summer spot. Oh, and the second name will get the um, the teams that we took out, the Padres, Royals, Tigers. One, seven times. Two, three, four, five, six, and a one. Seventh and final time. Name on top after seven times. Jeremy Terrell. There you go, JT. A little something for you there. And Patrick K, you'll get um, any Padres, Royals, Tigers cards that may have been in there. So there you have it. Thanks very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We will see you next time right there for the next break and more of this. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.